Hi, it's me, Zay for Beeblebrox, the British tech guru. Now, my curiosity had me wondering if I can't fix this somehow. And it has supplied it, cleared, clearly doesn't work, because that just should be attached. Okay, so, flies. Let's turn this up. Oh, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Loose screws, okay. What's hiding behind these? What is hiding behind these? Oh. Aha! Do you see what I see? I see an Allen screw. What size Allen screw is it? Oh, that fits. Amazing. That's a uh, two millimeter Allen screw. Hmm. Right. I think I know how. To, oops. I think I know how to fix this. So we'll put that, well first off we'll take the cover plate away, we'll put that into there like that, and let's tighten that Allen screw. Okay. That's a little bit hard to turn, so let's slack it off a little bit. Okay. Probably needs a little bit of thread lock in there. Yes, that would be a rather good idea, thread lock. So let's back this out. And we'll pause just for a second while I get thread lock. Well, don't have any thread lock, but I've got the next best thing. Nail polish. So you can get this open. Oh God, that smells terrible. Okay, we've got black nail polish on it, so we'll just screw that in now. Tight and backed it off a little bit. That will turn when that thread lock dries, or other black nail polish dries, and yeah, tells you what the kind of girl I used to date, and she left uh, left half her nail polish. Um, anyway, put that. So that should dry, and that should be locked in place. So we shall seal this up. Oh, maybe I should put thread lock on it. That would be a good idea. That would be an excellent idea, if I say so myself. I don't want to have to take this thing apart again. I don't want it to come apart when, it, if I end up using it, because then the drill press itself is absolute trash. But let's see what we can do with this. So put that there. Let's hope we get that screwed in before the thread lock dries. Nail polish rather, whatever the heck it is. Okay, got that there. So screw that in. Okay, we 
we've got that in there and that's tight so now put some more thread lock on oops more thread lock on this one and we'll screw that into there just like that that's this stuff dries appallingly quickly but it's excellent for use as thread lock okay put the cap back on that's actually probably cheaper than the actual thread lock probably since it I think that she bought those from a dollar store anyway so now we can consider that to be fixed so that's probably usable now um, hmm drill press I don't have a clue about fixing I think the drill press is probably more of a problem than the actual drill itself so well at least I fixed something <laughs> 